good morning goenkans hope you all are doing well the goenkans from today we are going to start revision for all the chapters that we are done with so far in evs and uh, today's chapter that is chapter number 3 water page number 12 the goenkans uh, this revision will help you to understand recapitulate revise all the topics of topics and clarify your doubts if any so let's go start it i hope this uh, so far whatever we have learned for water and the chapters that are associated with it and that water is an important part of our life right and uh, in other words we can say water is essential for the existence of life without water there would be no life on earth fine and i have been telling you about that man can survive without food for 2 months but cannot survive for more than 3 days without water so this statement can give you an idea about the importance of water so they going kids now when we know the water is essential for our survival and uh, we should be knowing that it also serves a number of functions in our body so water is very much important for maintaining the temperature water is very much important for the transportation of many nutrients and minerals in our body and nevertheless it's very much important for removal of certain toxic wastes from our body that's how water is important for our lives but take goenkans do you know water is not just important for human beings it's also important for plants and animals fine plants and animals also are very much dependent on this water they also require a huge amount of water to carry out their activities dependency of um, animals is same as that of the human beings like for their body temperature transportation and removal of toxic wastes but when it comes to plants their uh, dependency is different like they need it for their growth as well as they need it for their germination of seeds fine nevertheless their transportation of nutrients is also dependent on this water if they want to transport different nutrients from the soil to the different parts of the plant they need water for that and uh, the very important process that are rather we can say a life um, continual process that is photosynthesis that is a food making process is also dependent on water now in order to understand this uh, importance of water for plants we'll be doing a simple activity for that what you need to do is uh, you need to have a potted plant and this uh, healthy potted plant should be there and this uh, you will keep inside your homes and uh, then you will start observing it for few days fine during these days you need not to water it fine and uh, now what you will do is to, uh, the important thing is to note the changes when you have stopped watering it if there are any changes you need to write down all these observations on a daily basis on your evs text notebook and uh, giving me idea that whether water is important for our plants growth or not that's all for today thank you stay safe stay home thank you going